Hey, welcome to Chiman Dunja. This is Douglas Chan. Today we're going to touch on how to read a Chiman chart and how to plot a Chiman chart. So when you want to do a divination using Chiman Dunja, the process is going to be like this. You have to ask a question and you have to base on the app to do a chart creation. So there is many chart creation for Chiman Dunjia in the market and most of them are pretty reliable. When I say reliable meaning that their information are I would say 99% pretty accurate in terms of the, the formations of the chart. So what happened is that when you want to do a divination in terms of this Chiman uh, Dunjia it will give us the indication of what are the result is going to be and what are the outcome is going to be and sometimes we can even see why is it going to be like that and maybe we can even change the result due to a specific uh, arrangement or even uh, knowing the problems so uh, I will give a very brief information about how to do a divination because this is a very, very big and very complex subject. But just I just touch base on the very specific things, alright? So, uh, if you see this chart itself, this is a, a qi men chart. So, how do we read the qi men chart is that when you plot the thing, the, the app itself, the chart, will based on the exact time that you ask. That means if you ask now, in the 18th of uh, January 2019, then 12 o'clock 50, 12 50 in the afternoon. This is the timing that you plot because that is the moment that you ask the question. All right, assuming that this is the time, it's 2019, January 18, 12 50. Right, so based on that timing itself, this is the information that is reflected over here so how do we see this chart so what, what what is your question so for example should i be investing in this business okay so you have to see two things first of all this is a day stamp this is an hour stamp the answer, generally speaking, is at the hour stamp. And hour stamp in this instance itself, if you see the spelling, it's called REN, it's called REN. So we have to locate the answer in the REN box, in the box, nine boxes within, and find the answer over there. So REN is over here. This is box one. We always look at the top. If you see, in another box, this is uh, box number 3. There's a run here, there's a run here also. In Qi uh, Man we always look at the one at the very top. Okay, so which means that we ignore the one at box number 3 and we look at this one over here. So from here itself, the box, what are the signs over there that's telling us what to do? So every one of these uh, 9 Earth, Obstruct, impulse is telling us a story. So with these signs, we will have to create a story and give us an answer. Of course, every one of them it has certain positive or negative things that there's a there's a dictionary on this in every sign. It's not so simple. Alright. So from there itself we have to look at the box number one. Usually box number one, which is the one Reflecting from this hour stamp, which is the run, we always look at box number one, which correspond with this run. So in the case that let's say, in the different timing, if the hour stamp is different sign, then you have to look at the different sign itself. You see, so which means that you always follow the sign. So to make it simple, let's say, uh, if you see this run. It's already reflecting, there's a small box over here. It's automatically telling you that this is the answer to give 
you very simple in terms of uh, choosing where is the answer. In generally, we are talking about the hour stamp is the answer. But if you talk about friends, you ask on behalf of a friend, on behalf of brother, sister, father, or boss, then the answer will not be in the hour stamp. It will be in this or this, depending on how senior the position is. For example, if you talk about uh, father, or, or grandfather, then we have to look at here, the year stamp. Year stamp is the answer for grandfather, father, or boss. So we have to look at over here. So there are always condition depending on who is the person. That means the house, the senior it is, the box to choose will be different. All right. So there's a there's a formula also. So in in this aspect, if you talk generally speaking, we always talk about our stem. If you talk about more senior like brother, sister, elder brother, elder sister, you know we all use this man stem to to take reference. If you talk about grandfather, father, senior, or even like bosses, then we have to use the the year stem to see the answer. So choosing the right answer. In the right box is very important because if you use the wrong one then the answer will be very different all right i will only touch base on this thing itself in terms of choosing the the stamps and then from there we will i will cover more in terms of how to read a definition chart in chim and tunja all right thank you for watching